Hello one and all, this is Luckless Lovelox and welcome back to Kona. I couldn't find any fire starters around these parts, but I think this lantern actually might help us with the cold. I think it kind of keeps it at its place, so I'll maybe have to use this and just see what I can do. And what I need to do is stick to the right hand path all the way and I think, hoping, I'm hoping I can make it. Wish me luck guys. Okay, now do I turn right here? I could, I could. Let's do that. I just gotta, I gotta keep moving. I gotta keep moving. It's just so easy to get lost. Please, no more wolves. I'm sufficiently freaked out, guys. <laughs> oh, what is that? them oh no two more victims of this ice plague carl felt a chill down his spine what if he was next we can't we can't go into the spirit world here oh god there's something ahead the sanctuary felt the strong pull of a vision overcome him. A simple hunting accident. That then must be the Carl recognized him. That must be the Aboriginal woman. A major hunting accident. Doctor examined the young woman. She's bleeding a lot. But death couldn't be overturned. She was dead. They buried her, right? To hide it.
It was not the type of body you buried in a big ceremony in the village graveyard. It had to be hidden. No one could know about this. The best way to do that was to have a simple-minded man bury the poor girl. Lamott, the mechanic. Mm -hmm. denied the unfair death of the young woman but Hamilton had him in his grips Hamilton knew all of the poet's secrets and wouldn't hesitate to reveal them I know all about your crimes you little communist you know mine what a sordid affair understood the ins and outs of the affair. A woman had been killed in an unfair accident, and a young warrior had damned himself to avenge her. And so the beast could not quench its thirst for vengeance. And now, recklessly, Carl had pulled the bolt from the beast's heart. Oh my god. The beast, who was but a young free man lost without his fiance. Oh and had, out of hatred, become Wendigo. Oh my god! Do I shoot it? It's bulletproof. What? Wait, wait, what, what do I have? What do I have? Lantern? Oh my god. Do I have anything else? All I have is the gun. The axe. I don't know what else to do. Holy shit. I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. Where's the hunter? Oh shit. Okay, it's useless, it's useless. I just have to run, I think. Look at this thing. Fuck. Another wolf. Still after me. There must be something I can do. Oh my god, we're getting to the end! Shit! We're trapped. Am I trapped? Am I trapped? I don't know, I don't know where to go! Do I just, do I just go for it? Oh my god!
I think I have to confront it. I think I have to confront it. Holy shit. I have no bullets left. I have no bullets left. Use the freaking hatchet. Do something. Oh my god. What am I supposed to do? I think I just have to run. I think I just have to run. Yeah, no kidding. I should use a flashlight or lantern. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, let's get that gun equipped. Oh my god, that's so fucking freaky. I don't know what else to do. Like, I, I, I died to it. I thought maybe I had to die to it, but I think I just run. I think I just run. I remember there was a boat. Oh man. There was, a, there was a boat in the map. Remember that boat launch? I think I need to make it to there. go hold on oh you can look at the map wait I'm totally going the wrong way oh fuck is it this way no I'm going now I'm going the wrong way shit This is it. This is the right way. This is the right way. I need. I need some first aid. Get the gun out. Move. Get the gun out, Carl. Okay, I have. I have ten shots left. Wait. 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 Straight ahead. Right? Oh god. Another one? Oh man. How are we doing? How are we doing on health here? Painkillers. Going the right way still? Yes, 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 yes. We're making it. Get the get the gun out. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna equip the pistol. Oh my god! It doesn't take them out. Where did the wolf go? Shit! Carl, come on, Carl. Must have some more first aid. Good. 
Yes! Fuck! Oh, I missed! We're back to the bodies. What? The cemetery. I'm out of bullets, I'm out of bullets, I'm out of bullets. Oh god. Hatchet, yes. Oh man, I'm just running, I'm running, I'm running. Yes, this way. Yes! Oh my god. Do it, Carl! Get the hell out of here! Get the hell out of here! Wait, am I going the right way? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I am. You know what, just in case. Just use everything we've got. Get that hatchet out. Where do I go? Where do I go? Holy shit. This way? I don't know. I don't know how I get through the fence. Must be this way. Are you serious? How do I get? Oh, there we go. There we go. running it's running holy shit there it is right Carl yes So did purity. I would defend purity against the winds, the tides, against ice and blizzard. Could it be that all this was but a story of justice and vengeance? The soulful doctor, avenging his fiancée's unjust death by avenging this young woman as though she was his lover. Are these passionate feelings not precisely the kind of feelings that could cause a storm, petrify people deep inside, create monsters? Cool. All right, I'm going to be quiet during the credits. I'll speak to you guys afterwards.
Un survivant On a trouvé un survivant The backers. Okay, I'm gonna talk through the backers. We don't need to see all those. I really enjoyed the game. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching me play it and kind of going on this adventure with me. I was actually pleasantly surprised at how good the game was. It's got a lot of rough edges, which is to be expected from a smaller budget game, but I was surprised how many people worked on it. Um, this is a bigger game than I thought than I thought it was. Um, I really liked the atmosphere that they created for the game above anything else. The writing was okay, uh, could have been a bit better. The, the narrator was it was interesting, a, a different take, and the game just felt different from what you're used to playing in this genre. I like the freeform investigation where you're just, they throw you in this world, they tell you the stuff that's like important that you found, and it's up to you to like follow the leads from point A to point B to point C and so on and so forth. That I really like, but what ends up happening is it creates situations where you're kind of lost, which is fine because that's the way an investigation is supposed to be, so it kind of like immerses you in that world uh but like stuff at the like at the end i was like so confused I was like what am i supposed to do am i supposed to run am i supposed to get killed am i supposed to like fight as much as i can uh, am i gonna get saved so like just things like that um were a bit confusing i actually the survival elements te were pretty good they really they kept me like engrossed in the world without being like too overbearing except for like at the end there where i just didn't have enough resources to like light a fire that you know just got me killed um i love the like the uh supernatural elements i thought that was really well done um i didn't predict actually who the creature was i thought it was the girl i thought it was the girl who like rose up from her grave to get revenge on the city for killing her i didn't expect it to be um as far as i understood the girl's uh like husband or her or boyfriend um kind of getting revenge for her and interesting like I don't know if I buy that the doctors the reason why the doctor murdered Hamilton that it was like the killing of the girl reminded him of his of his wife um and therefore killed Hamilton and then the the whole communist connection was a little bit I don't know loose oh is there gonna be more One thing, oh, okay. One thing I did want to mention is they're they're making three more games like this, like not like in maybe in this world and in this style with some different mechanics, but similar to this in terms of I guess mystery and storytelling and, and things like that. So that'll be really cool to to check out what they do next. Just I, I don't know, just like a little bit more polish, especially in the ending. I would I would have loved. Make the area you have to travel shorter so it's a bit more obvious what you're supposed to be doing. Um, but aside from that, I really enjoyed the game and uh, it was really cool reading your comments and uh, getting feedback on uh, on my playthrough. Um, that's it. Uh, if you guys did enjoy it, don't forget to like uh, like the video and subscribe to my channel, youtube.com slash Andrew Erdeg. That's E-R-D-E-G. And uh, also you can check me out on Twitch twitch.tv slash lucklesslovelocks follow me on twitter uh at andrew erdeg that's my name and you can find out when i post videos and when i go live on twitch and if you guys have a couple bucks to spare you can check out my patreon at patreon.com slash lucklesslovelocks i want to thank the developers parable again for giving me a copy of this game to play for you guys it was so awesome let me know if you played it and what you thought about it and what you thought about the playthrough feedback is always appreciated and uh, yeah, any support you give on Patreon really helps me out a lot. It allows me to buy new games, new equipment, and just makes the my stream and my videos even better. And uh, for kind of, I would love to do this like as a job, so it would help me help me to do that as well. That's it. This is Luckless Lovelock signing off for good on Kona. Really enjoyed it. I hope you did too. And I love you all. Oh, one other thing I want to mention. The music's really good. I forgot to mention that. I really like the music. See ya.